Mascard. Do you have Mascard comics in yeah. Australia? Yeah. Okay, okay, this role playing if game. You're not, yeah, if you're not reading Mouse Guard, that's a problem. You should. This role playing game makes the Mouse Guard comic just happen in your living room. I know it'll basement. probably cost you like $10 more than it cost me to get Mouse Guard, but I'm sure you can get it digitally, maybe, for the same price, Comixology or something. Read this, Mouse Guard, holy shit. This game just makes the Mouse Guard comic happen so easily and so quickly that it's almost amazing. Right, and the key mechanic in this game is that it's a turn taking game, not in the same way the other ones are turn taking. It's GM turn, player turn. GM turn, player turn, right? And it starts with the GM's turn. So when the GM's turn, the GM throws stuff at the, at the mice, right? It's like, oh, little mice. Now it is time for you to deal with the badger. Oh, yes, the badger is chasing you. What will you do? Oh, you survived barely, but you lost your sword when you stabbed the badger. Now what will you do? As it rains, it makes everything muddy. Yes, you are tiny mice. Mud is a big problem. Big problem. Oh, you escaped onto the beach where there is no mud, but there are crabs. Yes, what do you do about the crabs? Oh, you cut off their eye stalk. Oh, you managed to escape. Okay, that is all I can think of now. I am the GM. It is now your turn, mice. What will you do? During my turn, you little mice earned some number of clicks based on your role playing, right? If you role play well enough, you can earn more clicks. And the number the thing is checks, actually. It Whatever. is checks. Checks. You earn checks. And you I wasn't going to correct you on stage. Whatever. You, you can use the checks during the mice turn to do stuff. Okay, so it's like, okay, mice, it's your turn. What'd you get? Three checks? What are you going to do with the three checks, mice? Okay, one, you're going to get a new sword. Yeah, you left that one in the badger. Yeah, so I thought. Two, what else? Oh, some shoes. Yeah, you're going to go buy shoes to deal with, you know, the mud that's going to happen again. And three, oh, you're going to heal that wound you got from the crab fight. Yeah. Oh, is it my turn again? Oh, you're on the Mice Beach Resort, and it's high tide. <laughs> oh, what now, Mice? That's pretty much how the game goes. Now, look at this economy. You play d d You have the situation again where someone's, someone's rolling a whole bunch of dice because they're louder than everyone else. You have to earn the right to roll the dice in this game. As a result, every time you roll dice, it fucking matters. In d and I roll d20 a thousand times, and maybe the average of all those rolls causes an impact on the game. And this maybe game, one of those rolls would be super big and have everyone at the table going, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, right? But every single roll in this game is, oh shit, especially when you only get like two or three and you earned a check and you're going to make a roll for it. It's like, okay, I earned the right to roll the dice to try to get shoes. I didn't get the shoes. <laughs> I don't get the check back. When we played D&D, I would just like literally fall asleep during combat. I was like, oh, I play pacifist, my character runs away and hides until it's over, and I'd fall asleep. And no one was really paying attention when it wasn't their turn. But I think some of you were in that boat, too. In this game, when someone's like, I'm going to roll some dice, everyone kind of stands up like, oh, we're rolling dice. They stand there, and everyone watches silently while you like, prepare to roll your dice. It's a big deal. Big deal. So if I'm going to tell the story of my character here, I'm not going to talk about my strength stat. That's not interesting. And it turns out that that's the only part of my character that is character, that is story, who he knows, what he's done, where he's going, why he fights for what he fights for. That's it. And that whole character sheet, that's it. Yeah, so, you're trying to tell me this is a role-playing game, but what percentage of it has anything to do with role-playing? That percent. And most of that is a picture. Now you've been